Good morning and welcome back to subsistence. We've got a hunter attack, oh my gosh. Oh my goodness. Grenade arrow to the face. <laughs> oh my god, that was that was a bit of a, that was a bit of a shock, I will admit. Make sure he's not going to launch one at me. Oh my words. Wow, that was quite, quite a surprise. There's an arrow in my wall there. Uh, I would say they've probably done quite a bit of damage there. What a start. What a start to the morning. Jeez, they bought me some breakfast at least. Right, they bought me a grub. No, I didn't hear them arrive at all until the very last minute, so it just shows you how much faster they swim across. Wow. <laughs> oh my gosh. Let's see how much damage they've done. We might need to do some repairs. <gasps> yeah, I'm going to grab the stuff and do some very quick repairs while my um, food, my breakfast is cooking. Oh my gosh. Just the one bit of meat, but that will that will do. Um, okay, we've got a shotgun shell. Let's top the 44 up. Um, we've got some grubs. Right, let's get the hammer. We need wood, nails. Oh, and glass. Glass fragments, okay. Get this done quickly. I don't want to be here all day. Got a lot of things to do today. That's I'm quite I'm quite surprised about the ferocity of that attack there. Um, wow! Look how much damage it's done. Is that new? Is that sort of new improved hunter? You know, because I've got quite old hunters. They've been on the map a long time now. They're quite established. I think that's probably all the damage that was done, but let's just check everywhere. We've got our food still going, so I don't want to burn that, but... Well, we've got everything in our inventory. <gasps> our pool window! Right, any damage on here? Yep, a little bit on there, and probably on the floor too. Nope, nothing on that one. Okay, and uh, that'll do. Let's get back upstairs very quickly before our food burns. Oh, very good. Right, oh my god, look what we've got. We're going to have to get some glass down to 37. Yikes. Uh, we've got another match. They keep bringing me matches. I have no idea why. Um, let's put all this stuff away. Um, nails, sorry, they go down there. At least we've got plenty of nails. We could do with getting some wood. Could do with getting a little bit of wood. Uh, um, right, let's put the potassium in here. And we'll have a look. Um, do we need to refine anything? We've not got that much power. It's not bad. Um, I might split that, get that finished off, leave these in here. And we'll let the power build back up today because um, we're going to have to go out and get some more um, metals anyway. I think I'm going to eat that now. Yeah, and let's grab um, you know, a couple of berries, top us all the way up, and we'll put that grub away. Now, who was that? Who was that? That's the question. Let's grab the um, SVT and see if we can see. It's not those guys, because they are walking across there. Uh, I don't think it's... No, it's not those guys either. So I think it's that big base again. There's three. 
there's at least three of those hunters there at that one but what we'll do is we'll see if we get another attack and if we do we'll, we'll go over and have a look at taking out the base i don't think it's worth it just at the moment i want to get out there and do some looting and i'd like to see if i can find a deer we saw a deer at the end of the last episode swimming in the uh, in the lake just outside the base which was lovely too dark to do anything about it unfortunately but it was nice to see that they do come this close there were a few crates around here this morning when I looked out so I'm gonna grab those and see if we can find a is that a lot crate nope that's a, a normal crate So I think what we'll do is we'll make this about, uh, probably about looting today. Uh, just after an update is a great time to go out and get some good loot. So as you can see, there are crates everywhere. But I hope you're having a good day. This is my second time playing the game since the update. I am desperate to try and find some adhesive. So lock crates and hopefully we'll stumble across a deer. And then we can make the ladder, the ladder hatch. Uh, doesn't seem to be much more that way. Let's, ooh, what we've got here, is that zinc? Ooh, <laughs> kind of popped up there. Yeah, a little bit of zinc. So I'm recording this on Saturday evening. Uh, before the live stream later on tonight. Um, I'm really looking forward to trying this out on co-op with Game Edged and Ono. Oh and Selena, I think uh, Dread is away this weekend. I don't think he'll be joining in. But the the rest, rest of the gang will be, will be there. I need to run. <laughs> Got a bit close to that bear there. I don't know which one it was because I didn't think I was that close to that bear. There must be another one behind there. There's more ore on there, look. There is more ore. Let's circle around and see. We'll just investigate what's going on there. Might have a quick look down here for a lock crate. And we'll pop back up and just see what's going on when we come out the other side. Right, there's all sorts of fibres and things around, which can be a bit distracting, they kind of... But they do lead you, they do lead you through the loot. So it's good to follow them if there's nothing else around, for example. Okay. You've probably noticed in the last couple of games, I've hardly done any hunting. Uh, I've got so many protein bars. I should be keeping them for the animal coop. Um, if I ever get round to making one, that is. Because that's great feed for the animals. Rather than using all the precious uh, vegetables and kelp. Wow, there's all sorts of crates around. So um, we'll have a look on ore rock in a moment. There were rogues just down there the other day. Uh, I imagine they're probably still there. But as I don't know when they moved in, they may well have relocated by now. But we've got a couple of crates down here. Yeah, we're good. Oh, I am so looking forward to building one of the ladder hatches. Um, just need to get that uh, adhesive. Need to find uh, a deer or two. Uh, I probably should. I should be out hunting wolves, but I had a look in my plant bed earlier. And last time out we planted um, uh, medicinal plants and you can turn those into biofuel. So that kind of makes sense now. 
I know a lot of people at the time questioned, well, what do we need all these for? I've got more biofuel than I know what to do with. Well, yeah. But now we can turn it to our advantage. And craft up some more uh, biofuel. For all these recipes that require it, so... It's all good stuff. Right, there's uh, medicinal. I'm grabbing them all. I'm actually down to, I think, my final stack. I mean, there's a lot. I've got a lot of them that I'm not running short, but I am down to one stack. Let's have a quick look on here for any ore that might have spawned. Try not to miss any. I always say that now. Oh, were they there a minute ago? Just the way I whip the camera around then, I think. Whoops. I haven't uh, seen any deer yet. I haven't really been looking too hard though. Uh, keep spotting things out the corner of my eye. We need iron. We need iron for all these things we're crafting. There's a wolf there. Didn't see that. At all. Until that last moment. Um, I think that's about it. I am running back towards the wolf. Yep, that looks like it for now. We'll come back. I may have missed one or two, but with that wolf there, I don't think it's why he's hanging around anymore. Let's go back over to where that bear was. Um, hopefully he will have moved and we can get to that ore that was on the rock. Um, if I remember correctly, it was at the end of this little gully. Where did that just pop in? I'm not sure I spotted that initially. Bit of biofuel again. Always glad to have that. Oh yeah, he was the other side of here, wasn't he? Right, we'll run through then. Have a bit of a closer look. For a lot crate in this area. Let's get up here where we can see what's around. Right, there he is. Um, he's coming back this way. Let's go around here then so we don't start limon get his attention. Now it looks like that ore has despawned. It was on here. There was a couple of pieces. Yeah, they've gone now. That's okay. We'll still have a little wander around here. It's a prime lock crate area. There's something down in the grass there. I couldn't quite make out what that was. That's a funny colour. I think that's a fern, but really sort of stood out on the landscape then. Okay, we've got a wolf up ahead. Uh, I probably should be getting some wood, um, but I want to use the better part of the day of, to try and find a lot crate if I can. We're usually quite successful. Okay, nothing that way and nothing initially that way, but I really spun around there quite quickly, so I could have missed something. Have another look up here. I'm not sure I can see those rogues anymore. That's probably what's putting me off a little bit. Just looking to see where they are. Uh, let's go around here. I, I absolutely love this map. It's so cool to run around. What are you? You're a branch. Yep, nothing immediately visible. Of 
immediately visible that way either. Right, let's get out of here. Oh, there's a lock crate. Right. <laughs> That's awesome. Just keep looking. Just keep circling around and scanning and hopefully... Well, I was going to say hopefully we brought the lockpick with us, but we have. Yay! Oh my gosh! 13 adhesive. We can go and make our, um, our hatch. I'm going to get some wood and get back. Oh, that's fantastic. Oh, that, oh, that is brilliant. Right, let's grab some wood. And uh, hopefully we won't get uh, disturbed. That's brilliant. What an amazing amount of, uh, of adhesive. I'm going to go and grab these couple of trees while we're here. That's so good, 13. That's enough, hopefully, to do the hatch. We'll have a quick look. Let's just have a look at the recipe. I don't want to get caught out in the open here. Um, yeah, we only need four and, oh yeah, we're, we're good. I'm going to make that hatch. I could make two. I could make two. <laughs> That's brilliant. Oh, what a brilliant lock crate. I wish I had another lock pick on me. I have a good feeling that I could probably find another one today. I am very happy. That means we could actually craft this um, hatch up and get it installed and probably put our uh, super secret entrance hatching as well. I am going to make some wooden planks. Let's get some more wood. Where did that bear go? We probably need some sandstone as well. I'm not going to go swimming in the lake with a lot crate in the I think that's probably a bit dangerous. Oh my gosh. I'm so worried now that I've got this lot crate on me with all this adhesive. I really ought to head back in. Stick into the plan though, I do need wood, so let's get let's just get some wood and get it over with and get back. <laughs> I'm so pleased about that. That's brilliant. All in one fell swoop. We haven't even had to uh, look for a deer yet. we got 21 that's not really a lot is it let's grab a few more on the way this game just keeps getting better and better especially when you get a lot crate like that I can see some ore on that rock there I think I'm gonna go for that uh, 29, that's still not great, but let's get this ore. We need iron, just as much as we need anything else. And I'm going to have to stop and get some sandstone over the next couple of days. Right, let's sort of head towards a couple of small trees and grab a couple of logs. There's none directly in my path right now. Uh, let's get this big tree. There's a crate just on the, the right there but there is a, a wolf nearby. Get 
that crate. Probably not with him there. Not easily, anyway. Yeah, it's sort of walking back towards it, isn't it? Whoops. What are we up to now? Is my food and stuff going there much quicker than it used to? It feels like it is. It really feels like it is. Keep an eye on the water from both sides. Because they will be on me very quickly now. They're much, much better swimmers. They've uh, they've had some lessons. Forty six. Be nice to get fifty. So let's just grab this one. And we'll need just one more, uh, which should be here. Hopefully. Nope. I've already got you. Dum dum dum. Okay, we're good, we're good. You can see a crate up on the hill. Let's not worry about that, let's get in and make this hatch and then we can place it. Um, I'm thinking to replace this foundation in front of that door. We can move that foundation in a moment. I'll probably just put it outside for now. Uh, let's drop a fuel brick in and drop our ores away. Let's uh, probably split that in half and get this going. Put the um, zinc in there. Did we get any more ore? Not really. Uh, okay, that can go in, uh, in there. We've got some 44 as well, I think. Nice uh, amount of ammo in that crate as well and some feathers. Let's put the rest of this stuff away. I don't know what we need for... It's nice to get some wood though. I don't know what we need for the actual recipe itself, but we'll go and have a look in a second. I need to get some sandstone on the go. I'm, I've neglected my sandstone mining completely. 11 biofuels good as well. Uh, let's put you away and we'll eat the tomato. And um, we've got some more protein bars. <laughs> the game knows that's all I've been missing recently. Um, we need a bit more fruit. Let's do the plants. We'll get all the housekeeping -y bits and pieces done out the way and then we can concentrate on getting that build done. I don't want to get caught with a headshot because that hunter with the grenade tipped arrow that shot me in the face earlier that was very surprising <laughs> right we need a bandage and another health kit uh, we'll go and get some water and get that on to cook and then make this uh, hatch okay we can get rid of these stairs which will be nice now how do I yeah some reason I was pressing the wrong button. Nice. What was that noise? I heard a funny noise. I think that was in my house. Is that a deer? No. Just a bit of landscape. Put the grubs in there and... Right, let's get building. What do we need for this hatch? Uh, oh no, we'll put them on there first. Quickly. We've got building to do. Okay, build. Ceiling, ladder hatch, six planks, two ingots, and three scrap. Good job, we've got some wood. Three scrap, and two ingots. Uh, okay. Oh, copper. <laughs> Silly me. Let's make a couple of ingots. As we need one for the um, solar panel upgrade, I think. We've got one left. I've got one left to do, or did we do it? Hang on. If we did it already, then we don't need it. 
I think we did it actually. We did um we got it yeah, we got it installed. Nice, okay. 69% light. There's a crate down there. Any deer? I really want to get a deer. I'm not seeing any you're a bear. Any over here? If there's one local, I'll, I'll go after it, but I'm not going to go out running after one now. <gasps> there's a wolf. Right, what do we need? We've got one ingot. Let's go and grab one of the others that we've crafted. Actually, we'll grab, we'll grab them both and put one of them away in here. Like that. And what else was there? Wood ceiling. Ladder hatch. And we're going to need plates to upgrade it, which I think we already have anyway. Because it's going to get damaged down there, I think. So we'll take the hammer. And we've still got nine adhesive left. Let's put that away somewhere nice and safe. Um, where would be a good spot? I bet in here, yeah. Let's put that away in there. Gloopy. Oh, that's so good. Right, um... Let's uh, do water and I think we're all right for the plants. We did them, didn't we? Yeah, we're good. Let's put the water away then. Okay, let's get that on the toolbar and the hammer on there as well. Ladder. Now, where are we? Where are we going to move things? Um, I think this needs to be moved and to be honest I'm just going to put it there. The thing that I'm standing on now, uh oh, <laughs> the thing that I'm standing on now can be moved out so I better leave that open in fact. Uh, so crouch and move this one and we'll move that forward whoa big hole and then number six here and I think we want the ladder facing out that way don't we I think so <laughs> right uh, number five and we need to upgrade. Oh, how cool is this? Okay, let's put a light on then so we can sort of see what we're doing. So we've got our ladder exit now and a platform outside. Um, I've got to do something with all of these things. We can't use them right now. Uh, I could rejig all these. Are we going to get attacked? It doesn't look like it, does it? Um. Okay. We'll have a we'll have a little fiddle. Oh, I don't want to get attacked in the middle of this. That's the only thing, but. We don't need these stairs now. Um, let's crouch and move these ones. This is what we had to do before. Crouch and move these. This would have been better to do this in the daytime. Because this is a bit of a mess. Um, we'll stand on those to move that last set. Yeah, we can reach. That's good. Let's rotate. I don't know if we'll be able to do this from here. I'm at a funny angle. Oh, it worked. That's good. And then the spinal stairs. I'm standing on them. These aren't going to stay, by the way. These are definitely not going to stay here. 
How about that? We've got another set underneath. Let's crouch down and do those then. Just in case we want to keep these and use them for anything or, you know, I'll leave them intact for now, but I think I'm going to remove all of these and find somewhere else for this platform. Okay, let's have a look at how this uh, ladder thing works then. How do you get down? Can I just walk down? How do you get down? <gasps> oh, I just fell. Well, that's not great, is it? Um, that's two. Ah, there you go. I have to jump. Oh. I need to look at that in the daylight. I can't quite see. This is not staying. <laughs> None of that's staying, but it will do for now. I wonder if I can, I can actually reach that from down there. How do you, how do you nicely walk downwards? Do I press something? Ah, S. Okay, and then if I press V, can I use my glow stick while I'm on here? Yes, I can. That would make quite a nice screenshot. Just reaching for my um, print screen button. That's really cool. So it's S and W to move up and down. <laughs> That's so funny. I like it. I like it a lot. Um, let's come out of third person. There we go. I think that works really nicely. It's a bit... Um, oh, a <laughs> chicken watching me going, what, what are you doing? It's a little bit too high, but you can jump to it and I think that will fool the hunters. Um, I need to figure out what to do with these, but I do need some daylight. I think what I'll do is um, one of them uh, I'll definitely put over here in this tree that you can't see at the moment because it's too dark and one of them I'll put here against this tree to stop the hunters standing in the trees probably one over there in the bush that they always stand in and there's another bush that way I think that they stand in so we'll use it for some you know nicer base defences but uh, yeah I'm really pleased we managed to get that done and we've got some uh, uh, adhesive left over. We've got some plates left over, which is really cool. We've still got some sinew. We're doing really very well on all of these things. Uh, they're the wrong way around. I was just thinking something looks weird there. Now, do we have our plants ready? Let's... Uh, See, I've got a little bit of water and fertiliser left. They'll be ready tomorrow. So we'll just keep those topped up and then they will be done before we know it. <laughs> I really like that uh, ladder and I can make another one. Let's craft another one while we've got a few minutes before the next day. Uh, so we need, what, it was some scraps, three scraps two ingots was it? that that's the thing let's make another ingot two ingots this is why we need all the um the ores okay so we need a ceiling ladder hatch uh yeah one of the ingots and the adhesive should be ready now. Awesome. Now, this is going to go here. Now the problem is that I don't have an, anything underneath it at the moment and that's probably where I, oh, I should use those stairs in fact. Uh, let's move you and we'll just put you up here or something I think. For now. Uh, we need to make the ceiling. That would be useful, wouldn't it?
And I'll need my um, upgrade uh, plates as well. Uh, let's do you and the hammer. Awesome. Let's go back this way because there's a big hole in the floor. Okay, right, let's get this in place. We've got so much done, I'm really pleased. Uh, probably like that would be okay, wouldn't it? Yeah, I think so. Right, let's grab the hammer and I'm pretty sure I heard footsteps. Pretty sure I heard footsteps. <laughs> nice. Oh, I love that. Uh, okay, we've got one of you to replace another one on here somewhere. Where will, ne where will we need to replace? This one's overhanging. Let's do this one. So I think I'm going to de delete you. And luckily nothing will fall right now and we'll move you and this is slightly damaged in fact there we go so we've got the beginnings of this being upgraded that is so cool right let's put the hammer away and we better get uh, end in this episode because they will be arriving very soon oh there's a bag look at that that's lovely so we've got a lot of work to do got a lot of work to do just keeping an eye out for deer um yeah put these plates away Okay, that is where I am going to leave this episode. Really very pleased. Uh, we've got a lot done. I'm quite fortunate. Need to get another lockpick made and get back out there and see if we can find some more adhesive because that was certainly much easier than trying to find a deer. Um, so thank you so much for watching. Until next time, take care and I'll see you again soon. Bye for now.